Have you ever gone to buy a plane ticket and the next day it has a different price? Why is that? Well, let's explain the reason why flight prices change. No, before you go! 1. Profiling Airlines profile their customers to help them adjust prices. Working like this, they can separate them into different classes, such as business or economy, so that means a different price too. 2. Airline profit Despite what we all used to think, they don't get their main profit from third class. Nope, they get it from premium class travellers. Even though there are less premium class seats, their price is so expensive that they make more profit with them than they do with the entire third class section and also take up less space in the cabin. <laughs> 3. Booking in advance the airlines know that tourist passengers are going to book their tickets a long time in advance and are probably going to be shopping around for the best price. But business passengers' tickets often need to be booked at the last minute and seeing as it's their employer who pays for their ticket, they're less likely to complain about the pricing. So they take advantage of it and raise the prices for that period. 4. Basic Economy Fare the basic economy fare is actually created by a program that combines taxes and fuel, so we don't really have a person to blame for that. This is also a good thing, because customers can use websites that know the airline's algorithms and past data, and can predict the lowest price, so yeah, it's not that bad after all. 5. Price Discrimination Another reason for high prices is price discrimination, where airlines bump up the price on more popular flights. There are also travel agents or price comparison websites which can introduce a further level of price discrimination. And yes, it's legal. <sighs> 6. Days of the week there are some days in the week where it's more expensive mm. to buy your ticket. For example, Monday, Friday or Saturday are the most expensive days to leave because business travellers leave or return from their trip and families leave or return from their weekend trip. 7. Cheaper areas it doesn't always apply, but in general, if there's a lot of airlines competing in one area, the tickets tend to be cheaper. In these cases, it's better to buy tickets in advance. 8. Consolidated fares In the cases where you need to book a lot of seats for a flight and you do it through a travel agent, they can directly negotiate your fare with the airline to get a better price. 9. Trends Comparison the airlines also have programs that check previous fares and compare them, so that if tickets start to sell faster than before, the price rises. And if a competitor raises their fares, other airlines will probably raise their fares too. Which of these reasons do you find the most annoying? Comment below.